And now let's send it back upstairs to Vance Cameron for the call. Elm Grove Misty. Rock and Roll's image, Tell Me Why, Charlotte's Western, HP Ruby's Joyce, Dedham Vicky. Pay the line, Blue Chip. On the grandstand side, that's Jen's credit. It's the Thursday night finale. Post time. Up and pacing, leaving out Charlotte's Western. Rock and Roll's image, second, third into the turn. Tell me why, away fourth. Towards that inside is H.P. Ruby's Joyce. Then in fifth is Bedham Vicky. Away six, pay the line, Blue Chip. Seventh is Jen's credit. And the twelfth race goes under an inquiry involving the start by number one, Elm Grove Misty. Retain your tickets here as they move to the back stretch and arrive at the quarter. Leadership change. Rock and Roll's image will take over. Racing from second is Charlotte's Western. Tell me why around the turn in third. Then a racing from fourth. That's H.P. Ruby's Joyce. 29 seconds flat was the quarter. Then in fifth, along the rail is Bedham Vicky. Coming out of the turn in sixth, pay the line blue chip. Trailing the field, that's Jen's credit. They arrive at the opening half mile next, led by Rock and Roll's image. Second, Charlotte's Western. Tell me why third on the move and the outside fourth. Bedham Vicky is underway. Racing fifth at the rail, H.P. Ruby's Joyce on the outside. Pay the line, blue chip six. Trailing the field, Jen's credit, 59 and one was the half. They're on the back stretch for the final time, and they're chasing Rock and Roll's image to three quarters. Racing second at the rail, Charlotte's Western. From the outside, Bedham Vicky up into third at the rail, fourth. That's Tell Me Why. Pay the line, Blue Chip on the outside, fifth. H.P. Ruby's Joy, sixth. Trailing the field, Jen's credit, 129 and 2 was the three quarters with an eighth of a mile to go. Rock and Roll's image coming for home, the leader, Charlotte's Western to the outside. Tell me why, third, H.P. Ruby's choice at the rail. Deep stretch now, in at the rail, Rock and Roll's image in the blue night on the line. Second, that is Charlotte's Western, might have been H.P. Ruby's choice, third, one. 58 and 1 under an inquiry involving the start on number 1 Elm Grove Misty. Okay, we're going to get a look at the slow-mo here for race 12. If you've wagered on the one tonight, hold on to all tickets. There is an inquiry uh, whether maybe she received a fair start, but hold on to all tickets. But the nine, Rock and Roll's Image and Jason Hughes, they drew into post two, and they got to the front at the quarter. 29 flat, Charlotte's Western and Campbell, they tracked along in the two-hole through the half of 59 and one down to the three quarters, 129 and Two, Benham, Vicky, and Murner came first up tonight, but they just didn't have it tonight. And Rock and Roll's Image and Charlotte's Western, they battled down the stretch, and Rock and Roll's Image dug in late to fend off that late challenge, winning in 158 and 128 and 4 on the end of it. Big trip from Rock and Roll's Image and the Blue Knight Hughes to cap off a Thursday night here at Red Shores. In the winner's circle, that's nine Rock and Roll's image facing Black Mare six by Rock and Image. From the Pilgrim's Punch Dam, Rock and Roll Bluegrass, owned by David McDonald of Belfast, trained by Kevin Gillis, Jason Hughes, the winning driver, in 158 and 1. Rock and Roll's image in the nightcap. 
Ladies and gentlemen, there's a general refund of number one, Elm Grove Mixie in the 12th, not receiving a fair start. Race 12, refunding number one, Elm Grove Misty, not receiving a fair start. 